right, so I got your tomatoes. Uh -huh. I cut up everything you wanted. Uh -huh. So now how does this go together? Well, we got to cut these into wedges first. Okay, you want and me to do that? Yeah, if you want, like. All right, just And wedges. I'll work on the tomatoes. Does this have to be perfect? No, it doesn't. Okay. No. It's a very rustic recipe. Same thing here. I'm cutting up the tomatoes. But um, I don't, uh, you know, some people would say, oh, skin the tomatoes. Oh, or let's get it or, or seed them. No, no, no. Just chop them up roughly. It's a really delicious dish. Okay, how many uh, of these do you want? Well, uh, let's see how many we're going to be today. Getting all those seeds out. Yeah, I think you can usually get about six wedges out of an average size pepper. Mm -hmm. Take that vein out. And how's this? Is this enough, do you think? I think so. Okay, you fill Let those. Me get a bowl. Okay. Meanwhile, I'm going to put the tomatoes in a bowl. Great. And then I'm going to add the rest of the ingredient. I put in some tomato. I put in some anchovy, but if you want to, you could substitute tuna. That'd be Parsley good. and garlic. You want a little salt and pepper? Yeah, sure. All right, a little pepper. Good idea. A little sea salt. Mm -hmm. How about some olive oil? Doesn't need too much salt. Yeah, drizz, definitely olive oil. That's okay. the Not too much ingredient. salt because we have it in the anchovies. Right, and also the olives are going to bring okay. some salt. Okay. And then we're just going to put it in the oven and bake it for about... Um, I don't know, 45 minutes 45 until those minutes? peppers are nice and tender. Uncovered? Uncovered. Okay, exactly. let me get them in.